Earth's first mass extinction 2.4 billion years ago. Have you heard of the epic Armageddon that killed 99% of life on Earth? Fasten your seatbelts, fellow time travelers. Today, we embark on a thrilling expedition to the depths of ancient history, exploring a cataclysmic event that forever altered our beloved planet Earth, the first mass extinction that occurred 2.4 billion years ago. Join us as we unearth the scientific mysteries shrouding this event and find out what this means for the future of our planet. First, let's talk about the Great Oxidation Event. Imagine, if you will, the primordial stage of our young planet, a cosmic cradle wrapped in all its glory. Welcome to the enigmatic Precambrian era, a vast stretch spanning an astonishing 4 billion years, making it the longest chapter in Earth's chronicles. However, lurking beneath this cloak of time, dark forces awaited, ready to plunge our world into turmoil. Scientists have unraveled a critical player in the chronicles of this mass extinction, the malevolent oxygen. Yes, the very same element we rely on for our existence had a sinister role in Earth's early days. During this era, oxygen levels in the atmosphere escalated dramatically thanks to the prolific activities of cyanobacteria, the masters of oxygen production. Cyanobacteria evolved about 2.7 billion years ago and got to work in producing the noxious gas. Little did they know, they were setting the stage for their very own apocalypse. Eventually, things got so intense that oxygen was being produced at a rate faster than it could react with other substances to be used up safely. The ocean was said to be oxygenated to the point that the atmosphere itself started accumulating oxygen. Its presence reached unprecedented levels due to intense volcanic activities creating a nightmarish landscape that rendered life nearly impossible. This event is now famously referred to as the Great Oxygenation Event. Witness this celestial spectacle as oxygen kept building up in Earth's atmosphere akin to the exponential growth of a cosmic wildfire. However, here lies the irony. Oxygen, a life-giving elixir to us today, proved fatal to most life forms back then, like an invisible executioner in their midst. As oxygen levels surged, the atmosphere transformed into a battlefield for unsuspecting organisms. Oxygen embarked on a tumultuous union with hydrogen sulfide, methane, and countless other compounds. It was a chemical Armageddon, with oxygen radicals ruthlessly attacking any unfortunate soul within their reach. The delicate tapestry of life shattered, plunging the world into chaos. Survival of the fittest took on an unprecedented intensity. Mass modeling and studies have revealed that this event led to one of the first few ice ages on Earth. Methane's displacement by oxygen meant that global temperatures lowered enough to form ice sheets across the world. But oxygen toxicity alone does not account for the full extent of the mass extinction. Enter hydrogen sulfide, a vile and noxious compound that emerged as a menacing accomplice in this ancient tragedy. Volcanic activity was rampant during this era, releasing copious amounts of sulfur into the atmosphere. Hydrogen sulfide, a product of volcanic emissions, permeated the air, adding another layer of toxicity to the unfolding disaster. As oxygen levels continued to rise, an unfortunate chemical reaction unfolded. Oxygen radicals reacted with hydrogen sulfide and other compounds, setting off a chain of reactions that unleashed havoc upon the delicate organisms struggling to survive. The once life-giving oxygen turned into a weapon of mass destruction, indiscriminately attacking the very life forms it had nurtured. And so it began, the spiral of death and extinction that would reshape the course of life on Earth. The intricate web of ecosystems crumbled under the relentless assault, leaving devastation in its wake. Now, you might be wondering, how did we uncover the mysteries of Earth's first mass extinction? It's a tale of relentless exploration, ingenious techniques, and painstaking analysis. The quest for understanding the Great Oxygenation event began with geological expeditions, where curious scientists scoured the globe, hunting for clues buried deep within ancient rock formations. These rock formations, formed billions of years ago, hold the key to unraveling Earth's enigmatic past. By studying their composition, layers, and fossils, scientists started piecing together the puzzle. One crucial breakthrough came through the analysis of ancient sediments. 
These sedimentary rocks act as a time capsule, capturing a glimpse of the environmental conditions that prevailed during Earth's tumultuous eras. By examining the chemical signatures preserved within these rocks, scientists were able to reconstruct the atmospheric composition, providing vital insights into the events that led to the mass extinction. Isotopic analysis emerged as a powerful tool in the arsenal of Earth scientists. Isotopes are variations of chemical elements with different numbers of neutrons, and their ratios can shed light on ancient conditions. For instance, studying the ratios of sulfur isotopes allowed researchers to unravel the role of hydrogen sulfide during the extinction event. By meticulously analyzing the isotopic signatures trapped within the rocks, scientists unraveled the ancient secrets etched into Earth's geological archives. In addition to isotopic analysis, scientists turned to the fossil record for clues. Paleontologists meticulously studied the fossilized remains of ancient organisms, piecing together the intricate web of life that existed during that time. By examining the patterns of extinction and the composition of fossil assemblages, they were able to infer the scale and impact of the mass extinction event. To complement their findings, scientists utilized advanced technologies such as high-resolution imaging and spectroscopy to unlock even more information from the rocks. These cutting-edge technologies enabled researchers to visualize the minute details of ancient microfossils, unraveling the intricate relationship between the organisms and their environment. Through the collaborative efforts of geologists, geochemists, paleontologists, and an array of scientific disciplines, a clearer picture of Earth's first mass extinction emerged. Aftermath of the Great Oxygenation Event In the aftermath of this ruthless massacre, a myriad of species found themselves unable to survive. The delicate web of life had been irrevocably ruptured, leaving a dead landscape in its wake. But let us not despair, for life possesses a spirit to fight for its survival. Emerging from the ashes of destruction, new species emerged, laying the foundation for Earth's next chapter. These new species were notably different from the species that went extinct. Previous species utilized anaerobic respiration, as they did not require oxygen to stay alive and photosynthesize. Newer species were now part of aerobic life. They fully utilized the excess oxygen for respiration and metabolic activities. The Earth's first mass extinction serves as a stark reminder of the fragility of life and the intricate balance required for its sustenance. The ecosystem has remained in perfect balance as always, and this is proof that any disruptions can change the very existence of life as we know it. Undoubtedly, this mass extinction event highlights the incredible resilience of life itself. Despite the devastating loss, the survivors emerged from the wreckage, paving the way for the diversification and proliferation of new species. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of Earth's history, we gain a deeper appreciation for the intricate web of life that surrounds us today. Yet the significance of this discovery extends far beyond unraveling the mysteries of the past. It holds profound implications for our understanding of the present and the future of our planet. As we face contemporary challenges such as climate change, habitat destruction, and biodiversity loss, the lessons learned from Earth's first mass extinction become all the more relevant. It highlights the vulnerability of our biosphere and the interconnectedness of all species. Just as oxygen toxicity and hydrogen sulfide wreaked havoc during the ancient event, our actions today can have far-reaching consequences for the delicate ecosystems we rely upon. Not to mention, the discovery of Earth's first mass extinction reminds us of the importance of protecting and preserving our planet's biodiversity. Every species is a thread in the intricate tapestry of life, contributing to the resilience and stability of ecosystems. The loss of even a single species can have cascading effects disrupting the delicate balance that sustains us. On top of that, the scientific quest to unravel the secrets of the past presents an opportunity to refine our predictive models and enhance our understanding of Earth's complex systems. One of the key takeaways from this ancient catastrophe is the importance of keeping track of changes in the atmospheric composition. Understanding the interplay between different gases and their impact on ecosystems is crucial in safeguarding the necessary balance. The scientific endeavor to uncover the secrets of Earth's past also highlights the need for constant research. The quest for knowledge about ancient extinction requires the collaborative efforts of scientists from all fields. The scientific exploration of Earth's first mass extinction unveils not only the secrets of our ancient past, 
but also provides crucial insights into the challenges we face today. And thus, our accelerating adventure through time comes to a close, for now. We bid farewell to this mass extinction that shaped our planet, armed with knowledge, curiosity, and an insatiable hunger to uncover the enigmas that lie ahead. As we move forward, let us embrace the thrilling quest to unearth the secrets of our past. For in doing so, we illuminate the path to a better future, one that embraces the wonders of Earth and safeguards them for generations yet to come.